Well, the Cubans, I mean, the Cubans emerge from this crisis very angry. They feel that the, that the crisis was, was started and managed over their heads. Um, and Castro, in order to regain some credibility and respect and to send a message to the Soviets, laid out uh, five conditions. Um, one of the things he wouldn't allow was on-site inspection, which was something that Khrushchev had promised Kennedy. I mean, Kennedy said, I want to be absolutely certain you're taking those missiles out. Castro said, there's no way. Our sovereignty has been violated enough by the United States. We're not going to let it happen again. So from the Cuban perspective, this crisis produced anger and surprise, surprise at, at how the Soviets had taken them for granted. From the Soviet perspective, uh, Khrushchev did obtain a good concession at the end, uh, well, actually two concessions, one that was very public, and that was the American guarantee not to invade Cuba, and the other was a private concession that John F. Kennedy, through his brother, the Attorney General, Robert F. Kennedy, had given the Soviets, and that was to remove, within three to four months, the American uh, Jupiter missiles in Turkey. From Khrushchev's perspective, this was a reasonable outcome. Um, among his colleagues, most of whom had been against this whole idea in the first place, uh, there was a mounting resentment. And in fact, they brought as an example of, of, of Khrushchev's recklessness, they, they cited the Cuban Missile Crisis a year, two years later when they threw them out. So the, um, I think that the Kremlin um, is divided on, its, on the lessons it learned from the Cuban Missile Crisis and certainly divided in its understanding of whether it was a success or a failure. One of the things the Soviets took out of this crisis was, we can't be strategically inferior to the Americans any longer. We're just going to have to keep building missiles until we're not only equal with them, but superior to them in strategic power. And that's what they did, and they would achieve that in the 70s.